Security was tight at James Galata House, the provincial party headquarters. Traffic was rerouted along side streets. This meeting will bring major changes to troubled municipalities. But officials were caged about whether there would be any decisions around the redeployment of Nelson Mandela Bay Executive Mayor Zanotolo Waile. This after ongoing tensions between him and the regional chair Ngabafaku. There are issues uh, affecting governance, issues of municipalities and so forth. And I think uh, amongst the issues they are visiting is to ensure that the structures of the ANC are quite existing. Uh, the issue of Nkwasa uh, Zanadlamini reports are canvassed, communicated to structures of the movement and the general well-being of the ANC, including resolutions uh, that are emanating from municipal problems. The provincial executive has meanwhile welcomed Faku's resignation, even though it came as a surprise. Last year, President Jacob Zuma made two visits to the metro to defuse the leadership battles, which often resulted in violence. He is uh, resigning from the co leadership collective and uh, basically stating the reasons uh, that he wants to venture into another space and uh, do and continue with his business. Opposition parties want Wiley to also be removed, saying it will bring stability and improve service delivery. There's been this ongoing infighting in the ANC, mainly between the Faku and the Wahili camp. Um, the, the logical thing to do if you want to bring political stability to the area would be to redeploy both of them and bring in uh, new people in their place. There's long been rumours that Wiley would be redeployed to Parliament and a parliamentarian would be brought in to lead the metro. But with the little information coming out of today's high-level meetings, the fate of the massive metro is still unclear. Olutusota, SABC News in the Eastern Cape.